Hi, I'm Ning Yap. Hi, Michelle Yao. Welcome to Home Tour with the Yappies. Today, we are at Yishun Green Walk, Block 316C, where this is a beautiful, nice and peaceful environment. This block is only 8 years old, with 112 units, well distributed between 4 and 5 room HDB. And today, we're going to showcase to our audience a high floor, 5 room HDB flat is 112 square meter. Come, let's check it out, Michelle. Hey Michelle, this is the high floor unit that I was sharing with you just now. Oh, and I realized that it's very clean. Ding. Yeah, don't you think it's very important, especially you're staying here? Yeah, and we're heading to a corner unit. Definitely. In fact, you only have one neighbor beside you. Oh, very exclusive. Yeah, aren't you excited? Let's check it out. Come, let's go. Michelle. Stepping in here, do you feel that this corner is pretty well designed? Wow, yes. see? But we go all right. Mm -hmm. Can I just put my, put my shoes here? Exactly. In oh, fact, really? for me, I probably put a very huge mirror, knowing that, you know, we all like a look at ourselves. Yeah, we exactly. Oh, this owner has done a full carpentry here. The, the color is quite timeless. Exactly. Yeah, a lot of practical storage. Yes. You know, when you have a family and then when you have children and they're growing, so you need a lot of storage to store all their bar bar. I'm sure. And not only storage. Yes, you also have areas for you to put like your photo frames, mm -hmm. your displays. Exactly. Okay, Michelle, can you see this uh, living room? If you really look at this sofa set, it's a super huge one. Yes, and it's a good distance to your TV wall. Oh, yes, have a sit. If you sit down and enjoy like a soccer game or even to sing karaoke here. Hmm. Wow, I think this is a very nice uh, cozy corner. Yes, and because of the windows, mm -hmm. full whole row of windows. Yes. So the house actually is very bright. It's well very cheery. Yes. Yeah, and I remember behind us, it's now like the dining area yeah. used to be proposed as a study. Wow, okay. You mean behind here is study area? Correct. This used to be like maybe a proposed study area. Right. But I know of some people who use this as an uh, exercise corner. Right. A yoga yes. station. Mm -hmm. Actually, whatever you propose, right? I think the owner has done something like that. They, uh, they have a cardio machine here. Okay. So they can actually do their cardio while they watch their TV. You know, and usually after that, within an hour, what I heard is that it's good to have a hearty meal. Uh, and you won't grow fat. Yes. That's the best thing. I mean, if you really look at it, right, this uh, whole uh, layout is a little bit like the, some of the condo, mm -hmm. okay, where you can even have a uh, custom sitting here, so dining, and your living room. And in fact, if you have gas here, I think it's a huge place to house most of your gas. Definitely. <coughs> oh, Ming, there's a camera. Oh my god. Okay, Michelle, as you can see, right, this is a fun corner yeah just now we have experienced that okay that's why the family the owner did such a nice family area here yeah it's like a reading corner and then there's yeah. there are all the toys around here yeah like a play area yeah but it's very you know right um what do you call that uh, very <clears throat> encouraging you know yeah it actually inspired you to really get your creativity out here exactly you see how excited we are when we are here jumping on this. Yeah, true, true, true. Wow, then. Yeah, it's a nice place. Yeah. And I know what you love most. Yeah. We talk about the dining area. You're always game to check the kitchen. Shall we? Come, let's Come, go. Let's go. Okay, Michelle. Before we enter the kitchen, right, I always appreciate when there's a door. Mm -hmm. Because when you cook, right, whatever smell will be contained inside. And especially... Yeah glass door. Yes. Why? Because the natural light can be cast in. This kitchen, I think is a very good size. Very really look at it. If you see this cabinet here, okay, it's just directly opposite your cooking area. Okay, and they always say water and the fire shouldn't be together. I think it's more like some of the master's advice. I think so. I think so. Yeah, and uh, like you say, the colors very timeless. Okay, they have enough cabinets, top hung, bottom. When you look at this kitchen, right, we have a nice bomb shelter here that can double as a storage. Yes, what I appreciate Ning, about a bomb shelter in your kitchen is that, you know, a lot of times you have yes. canned food and you have bags of rice. There are so many things you come back from your grocery shopping. Yeah. Yeah. Can we put inside? Okay, anything that we should touch on here? 
No, I think it's really great. The the space is nice. Yeah. And have a lot of people who come to help out. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And most importantly, this doll separates your kitchen from your yard area. As I where you can always dry your laundry without the food smell. Mm -hmm. And this is a very good size yard. Yeah. Exactly. Dryer. You have a washer. Yeah. You even have racks to hang your clothings. Aye. Nice. Okay. So. I think we should check out the rooms. Yeah. This is the common bath. The size is superb. You can even do a wet and dry area here. Sure, okay, there's a window where it's well ventilated. Mm -hmm. Of course, uh, the new owner, if you like to, they can even do a vanity top. Okay, they can have a huge mirror with uh, maybe like a um, storage inside. Yeah. Okay, now this I realized, right? Only the owners, they actually put the acrylic on the ceiling. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. It looks like what oh. Elman. Yeah, yeah. Agree. Michelle? Do you know what's on my mind? I can sort of guess what you have in mind. <laughs> you know, it's like, it just brings back fond memories, you know. It's pretty young. Mm, yeah. You know, all the stuff, toys, yes. they're sleeping side by side. Yeah. yeah. And this room is so cozy for the little ones. And I love the beams. It's so cute. You know, when you're inside, right, as if you have all the sweet dreams daily. And look at this. It's so cute. Can definitely fit a queen size bed. Can even fit a, maybe a three feet or four feet riding table there. Ah, and you still have space for your full high wardrobe. Exactly. So this room, very good size. Mm -hmm. And everything is, you know, it's still in very good condition for the flooring. Maybe all you need probably is a fresh coat of paint. Mm -hmm. And you can just buy your furniture. Yes. And you can fit this room nicely. Yeah. And you'll be very personal. I totally agree. Hey, Rachel. See? Ah, oh, so this is the master room. Exactly. Check this out. Hey, how come the master room is so huge? You also feel it's big, right? Yeah. Okay, let me explain to you. Uh, when the couple, before they have their little ones, they want to enjoy. So you realize that this wall here, right? It's ah. actually, uh, they took it down. Okay, so basically, this is your common room. Ah, okay, I understand. Alright, so now the owner has converted this into their bedroom area. And then they also have two tables here. In fact, if you really look at it, the common room is quite huge. Yeah, it's actually huge. The master room actually starts from this side here. So if the new owner wants to put up the wall, they can. Because this is where the master room is. Ah, okay, I get what you mean now. Mm -hmm. Even with right now, we are standing where the master room section is, right? Yep. I'm sure we can put a king size bed. We can put a king size bed, we can put two side table, we can put another uh, dressing table. Uh, yeah, and then the wardrobe itself goes all the way up to the ceiling. Yeah, I can see that even the flooring seems quite well maintained. It's very well maintained. So the new owner just need to, if they need additional room, they just have to put up the wall, okay, and then the, this room becomes a master room. The other one is still a common room. Okay, let me show you the master bath. Right. Okay. So this is the master bath. It has a wet and dry area. Okay. Okay, so it's very bright as well because uh, oh. of the big uh, window here is well ventilated. So if the new owner feels that this whole place is very well kept, afterwards it's the owner own stay, they can actually retain most of the thing and save a lot of money. I'm sure. Yeah. This wet work is quite expensive. Exactly. Residents here can get your groceries, meals and daily necessities at the nearby Junction 9. And for more options and varieties, you can have a short drive to North Point City, Sabaon Shopping Centre, or Sun Plaza. And the much talk about Canberra Plaza has an array of exciting activities which has pockets of garden, trails, and water play park. When it comes to food, you are spoiled for choice with varieties of 44 stores at Bukit Canberra Hawker Centre. And if that's not good enough, look forward to the new transformed Chongpang City soon at the famous Chongpang Market. And for leisure activities, you can choose to exercise at Yishun Nature Park at Yishun Green Walk, jog along the park connector, which brings you to the Yishun Pond Park, or bring your little ones for a day of fun at the Oasis Water Park, or if you like to have a natural hot spring on our mainland Singapore, you can go to Sambawang Hot Spring, which is a therapeutic place to relax and enjoy free folk soaks. There are at least three buses that brings you to Yishun MRT Station in just three stops. Or you can choose a leisure stroll within 15 minutes to the MRT station. There's also a direct bus to CBD and Marina Bay Financial Center. Drivers heading to different parts of Singapore have the options of either the SLE or TPE. For parents with young school-going children, there are at least three childcare centers and kindergarten within walking distance, which includes Ace Kids at SG Private Limited, which is just at the opposite block 315C. 
and there are five primary schools within 1km, which includes Huaming Primary, Northfield Primary and Sishan Primary. If you want to build your love nest in a newer estate in Ishul, or you love space to create your ideal pre-bedroom with work area, or a high floor unit that's further distance from your neighbour, this could be the ideal unit for you and your loved ones. If you like what you see, do connect with us. Once again, I'm Ning Yap. I'm Michelle Yap. And do remember to subscribe to our YouTube channels for more home tours like this.